Hi, and welcome to this month's quick tip on wood procedural textures. As many of you have seen, Keyshot comes preloaded with many wood textures that can be used for a wide variety of applications. These wood textures are great for specific applications, but sometimes you want a little more control over the grain and color of the texture without having to tweak the image file in Photoshop. With the new wood procedural textures, users can now tweak parameters on the fly to make changes to the texture in real time. Let's start by first applying a plastic material shader to our part. Then set the roughness to a touch above zero to simulate the finish on the wood surface, and set our specular to white. Under Textures in the Material tab, select the color option so that it is highlighted. In the Texture Type pull-down, select Wood. You will see the grain of the procedural texture appear on our part. Click on the Mapping Tool button to activate the widget. If we select Scale and drag the handles, we can increase the size of the grain of our procedural texture. By using Translate and Scale, we can move the knot of our texture around the part. Click the check mark to finish the transform options of the texture. Click the color swatch of color 1 and 2 to select the colors from the main body of the wood and the grain. It might be helpful to find real photos of wood swatches online to help give us a starting point to where we can start tweaking our colors. You can use the eyedropper tool in the color panel to select a color anywhere on your screen. Once we have our color selected, we can start adjusting the values of our wood texture. Ring width adjusts the thickness of the grain. Ring noise introduces random fluctuations in each ring. while axial noise introduces fluctuations or waviness in the overall direction of the grain. Color noise creates random thicks and thins within each ring to give a more organic look to the grain. Scale increases the size of the grain. For best results, try keeping the scale low to simulate tight wood grain. While adjusting your parameters, it is helpful to refer to your wood swatch image to try and match the look of the real wood. With these new procedural textures, Keyshot offers more flexibility and speed in your rendering workflow than ever before.